Well, we don't say this very often, but it probably wasn't much of a fun ride home mm -hmm. after the uh, after the weekend. Everybody usually has one of these a year. What, what are your thoughts on just you know how the weekend went and definitely, didn't go? Definitely was not a fun trip um, there and back. But you know, yeah, like you said, every every year, every team has this kind of funk and this little stumble and fall. And as long as they are stay to few and far between, I can handle that. And it's just time to regroup, refocus. Uh, refresh. Basically, I just told them to flush it and let's move forward and focus on the things we need to focus because moving forward, it, it's ma it matters what we do at the end, not not this little trip and fall. Normally, we see a Lone Star Conference series and pitching wise, the pitching rotation. We've seen a lot of Kylie Halbert and Shaney Starkey, but we noticed a little bit that Stevie McLemore was starting to get in, in, more integrated into the lineup late in the season. Talk to us a little bit about that. Stevie stepped up and did a great job this weekend. She came in some extremely tough situations, and I think she handled it very well. You know, yesterday against International, they didn't hit her very hard. They just happened to get the little ones that fell in, the ones that you, you kind of go, dang it, how did that drop? But it, it's just those ones that happened. You know, Shaney had, a, had an off weekend. Kylie did a great job, but Shaney had a little bit off, and Stevie did what I needed her to do and step up in that position and, and try to help help us out. And, and I can't ask for anything more. I'm proud of what she did. And, you know, going forward, we're going to need her, and, and I hope that helps. This is one of the first times your team's kind of gone through adversity after a weekend. Like, so kind of talk about how important is it for the seniors to be there for like the sophomores and freshmen and kind of leading the way now. Well, this is definitely an important time for my seniors to step up in this, you know, challenge. They haven't had a lot of adversity to deal with uh, as far as getting four losses, especially in a row. And it, it's time for them to kind of regroup. I think they're kind of shock, shocked a little bit at it. And, and so I'm going to sit down with a couple of them and have that talk and say, this is what we've got to do moving forward. They're looking to you to be an example and, and how to handle this. And our challenge is to face adversity and overcome it. And it's not it's what we do and these things are going to strengthen us they're going to help us move forward and it's going to help us destroy what's in front of us and moving yeah does it also help with having someone like uh like Lacey taylor who's just there all the time assistant coach like basically having another senior on the squad does that help as well <laughs> kind of um you know she's a couple years removed in that that situation and so some of her her senior leadership and knowledge we've we've tried to incorporate and those seniors now played with her, so it kind of helps. They, they know that a little bit about her. And so she's able to give them a little bit of encouragement, a little bit of motivation, a little bit of guidance, and, and trying to help them overcome those things. Because she didn't start off great in those first couple years, and, and she developed into a fantastic leader. You know, And in 14, they had a great year um, as far as all of that goes. And so, I mean, all we can ask for is that they turn to her and, and look to her for some of that and moving forward. Can you talk to us a little bit about your matchup this weekend? With Eastern New Mexico, it, they're not going to roll over. They're not going to. It's not going to be an easy four, you know, three games. And they have a couple kids, a couple transfers that are playing well. They have some kids, like always, that swing the bat. You know, they, they're they're a group that goes aggressively at the plate. They have a pitcher that's done well for them in the circle. And so we can't take these games lightly. You know, we have to finish out strong and do what we do. And that's all I can <laughs> encourage our girls to do. Ramifications of what happened over the weekend with the other matchups and so forth. Do you? You think down the line about uh, you may be living on a bus again, or how do you, how do you, how do you live on it? I, I do, unfortunately, think we'll be living on a bus, but that's okay. Uh, you know, it, it's it's part of it. it. We tripped and fell, and, and now we just got to dust ourselves off and, and get up and move forward. Uh, I don't know what it will be this week. Um, you know, I hope it's not too bad, um, but, you know, those four losses definitely hurt us because those teams are ranked below us in, in that situation, and especially in the region. So. Um. The seniors have kind of been the talk over the course of these conversations, where it's looking to them at this point in time, and with it being senior day uh, or senior weekend, the final time they could be potentially playing on the field, uh, what have some of these seniors meant to the squad overall over the course of their career? These seniors have been a, a, an absolute force. I, I can't ask for anything more from them. Uh, they, they've done so much as it is, and I think going into this weekend, it's important. You know, three out of the four of them are four-year kids. They've been through some incredible highs, some some lows, <coughs> and it's some extreme challenges, but some, uh, most of it, a lot of success, and, and I think that attributes to a lot of what they've done and, and how they've prepared for their career and what they've done in their career, and, you know, I, I know they don't want to finish it and on a bad note. I know they don't want to, you know, end on with this taste in their mouth and they want to turn it around and, and move forward. And I, I think they're going to do a good job of, of getting the group back on track and, and redirecting the train and, and moving forward.